Welcome to this quick video about how to program RFID tags with the ThingMagic USB Pro Reader and the ThingMagic URA software. The ThingMagic URA software is a free software tool that is used for reading and writing UHF RFID tags for all ThingMagic RFID readers. To download the URA software, jump to our support article using the Universal Reader Assistant, available in the link on screen now or in the description below. I have already downloaded the URA, now I'm just going to open it and get started. When the software loads, connect your RFID reader. Today I'm using the ThingMagic USB Pro, so I'll go ahead and plug that in now and click Refresh. Click Next and then choose your operating region from the Next section. I'm in North America, so I will choose NA. Click Next and then click Connect. Once you are connected, you can see that the home screen has the Tag Results tab open by default. We can easily read our RFID tags right now by simply clicking Read at the top of the screen. However, today we want to program our tags, so click on the tab labeled Write EPC. As you can see, we have four boxes below. I'll walk through those functionalities now. The right to box has two options, first tag to respond and tag selected in tag results page. The software is asking if you would like to write to the first tag that responds or write to a specific tag on the tag results page. Typically, you should only have your selected tag in the read zone, so the first tag to respond option is usually a good default. However, if you would like to use a selected tag in the tag results page, simply jump back to the tag results tab, click read, and then stop reading when you find the tag you are looking for. Select the tag by right clicking on it and when the menu appears, click Write EPC. After that, automatically the Write EPC tab will open with the tag selected in Tag Results page toggled. The box How to Represent EPC is simply asking how you will be encoding your RFID tags. Will you be using hexadecimal encoding? using the numbers 0 through 9 and letters A through F, or will you be using ASCII that includes letters, numbers, and special characters? Reverse Base 36 is another programming option that's not commonly used. I will be using hexadecimal encoding today, so I'll leave the radio button the same as the default. The current EPC box will display the EPC number that you are about to reprogram. In this situation, since I selected one from the tag results page, this has already been filled in for me. If you choose first tag to respond, simply click the read button in the current EPC box so that the software can display the EPC number that you want to reprogram. The new EPC box is where you will type in the new data you wish to program into your RFID tag. Because we are using hexadecimal, we can only use numbers 0 through 9 and letters A through F. Also, since our memory bank is 96 bits, which then is divided by 4 for hexadecimal, we know we can only type 24 characters. I'll go ahead and type in the new EPC we want to program and then click Write. If the write is successful, a box will appear that reads write EPC is successful. And now, just to verify, I'll go ahead and read our newly programmed RFID tag. I'll change the radio button back to first tag to respond, and then I'll click read in the current EPC box. And as you can see, our new EPC appears. To learn more about how to use ThingMagic's URA software, check out our video, How to Use the ThingMagic URA Program, via the link on screen now, or available in the description below. Thank you so much for watching our video all about how to program an RFID tag using the ThingMagic URA software. Remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more RFID videos just like this one.